Talbot Systems debuted its Hermes 90 unmanned aerial vehicle at the Paris Air Show. I spoke with Danny Israeli, Vice President of Business Development and Marketing for Elbit, about the new vehicle and what makes it unique. The unique features of the Hermes 90 are uh, long endurance, like uh, up to 18 hours, uh, a, a large payload capability up to 25 kilograms, uh, which in this class of UEVs of up to 100 kilograms, uh, maximum takeoff weight, is a very uh, uh, unique uh, solution. Uh, usually the propulsion is uh, adapted to the uh, unique features of the air vehicle. So yes, we have a new power plant for the Hermes 90. It's a smaller aircraft. Uh, it has the capability to take off from a launcher and land on skids if you need point uh, launch and recovery, but it provides also the flexibility uh, to, the to the users if they want to take off and land on short runways. And this is uh, field uh, configurable. Uh, the Hermes uh, 90 is, uh, is a new system. It, uh, it's flying for the past uh, year or so, and we are uh, accumulating uh, flight hours. Uh, we expect it uh, to be uh, initial operational uh, capability within uh, this uh, following month with certain uh, customers. The Hermes 90, a small tactical UAV, formerly known as Skylark 2LE, has been rebranded as part of the Israeli company's larger Hermes family. The 15-hour-plus endurance Hermes 90 will also be offered for the U.S. Navy and Marine Corps STUAS Tier 2 contest under the new Elbit and General Dynamics joint venture called UAS Dynamics. This is Bettina Siobhan reporting from the Paris Air Show for Aviation Week.